Well, hey, it's Rob, and today I'm going to teach you how to play Thomas Dolby's excellent song, Flying North, on your acoustic guitar, if it's a thing you'd ever really want to do. Uh, I've been listening to this song for 42 plus years now, and uh, I don't know, for whatever reason, I just started strumming along with it and said, hey, you know, I can kind of get through this on the acoustic. You need a decent acoustic guitar that you can play bar chords higher up. I happen to be playing a Martin Sigma 1982, I think, 84, I don't remember, somewhere around the same time Flying North came out, anniversary model, but uh, it has good low action that I can play these bar chords, you know, higher up on the neck, and that's just kind of what you need to do with this song, it's an interesting composition, it's basically in the key of E, but it really features uh, chord tones that you don't normally hear, like the seventh, you know, the uh, D sharp, and uh, it's just kind of interesting, you know, what he chooses to, uh, you know, highlight in this song. I mean, it's basically, like I said, in the key of E, with the exception you have a D, which would be a flatted seventh degree. But uh, anyway, very interesting, cool song. If you if you know, you know. So uh, let's get into Flying North. Um, it's almost got like a Bo Diddley beat. Of course, Bo Diddley is... And it's got most of a Bo Diddley beat. Uh, maybe a little slowed down and mellowed out, but uh, you can kind of replicate what's uh, on the record. It is actually, I think, Kevin Armstrong, his guitar player, playing a, a, a similar riff on electric guitar. So you start off with the chorus in Flying North. It's just an E major. And that's your strumming pattern. And you go to an F sharp minor. Then you go to a D again, which is the flatted seventh degree of E. You kind of want to stop and mute with your hand. Uh, it's not as easy when you're strumming and singing, but uh, just for the purposes of demonstrating without singing, you want to kind of just mute it. I'm actually muting by just slightly removing my fingers off the neck. So if I have the chord, then I lift up, you get just no chord tones there. So once again, you're starting an E and cut them off. Uh, F sharp minor, D, back to E. It's kind of a cyclical thing. And then the next section starts with the F sharp minor again. And then C sharp minor, six degree. And then back to D. A double D. Now we get into the verse, and that's all there is chorus and verse in the song. It does two verses, then a chorus, then a third verse, and the chorus. It starts on the chorus of the song, Flying North. Uh, so the verse is, again, the seventh degree of the scale, which is a D sharp minor. Not normally what you'd hear, but that's where he starts off on when he does. Metal bird dip, wing of fire, back to the E. Whose airlines comb dark earth, back to the D sharp. The poles and tethers, we were born in E, and then F sharp. Oops, it's actually F sharp major there, but I'm playing them all up here. It's much easier to play them higher up. So what you'd kind of be doing is these bar chords, uh, D sharp. E, F sharp. So you're doing an F sharp major there, not a minor. Again, just an interesting compositional choice when you heard a minor tonality in the chorus. But uh, I'll try to sing it. It's hard for me to play the chords and not sing it. So you got metal bird dip wing of fire, whose airline come dark earth, pulls the tethers we were born to the F sharp and then repeats again. On the ring of a whole new deal, on the floor of a Pan Am bar, I'm staring right into the light. Here's where it tra uh, changes. It goes E, D sharp, C sharp, D sharp, E, C sharp, E, a D sharp, C sharp, and then it goes B, A, and it holds on to A. So once again, let's get through this verse. Uh, I'll do that. I'll sing the second verse. <laughs> 
you know, same chords. So, here come the men suits. E. Papers waving in the runway glare. D sharp. Think it's steaming in the chilly air. The mill morning E. And then up to your F sharp. Second uh, half of the chorus. Back to uh, D sharp. Um, where are we? Is it, uh, is it, the morning, Dinner. at the end of a double day, at the back of an airport lounge, D-sharp, I'm worn out, I'm, I'm staring in the cold and I'm E, D-sharp, C-sharp, D-sharp, E, D-sharp, C-sharp, Hold on A and back in your chorus. And the second half of the chorus starts with F sharp minor, um, C sharp, C sharp minor, and then D. And then, very quickly, once again, your verse chords are D sharp minor, E, D sharp minor, E, uh, F sharp major. I'm hitting that higher note, which I shouldn't, and I'm being lazy. I'm playing the bar with my pinky and my first finger. If you hit it too hard, you get that, but if you only hit the middle strings, you'll get it. Basically the right thing. Second half of the chord, uh, the verse is D sharp, D sharp. Um, I'm staring right into the light. D sharp, and I'm and not E sharp, E. So uh, D sharp, E. I'm staring right into the light, and I'm E. D sharp, C sharp, D sharp. sharp and then B just once and then you hang on the A another bar and then back into the chorus all right hope you got through that uh, it's kind of a thing you just got to feel out but uh, once you get the patterns down and everything and uh, see where things lay in this song you can actually handle it on acoustic guitar if you are so inclined all right thanks for watching later